At the beginning of the story, a city is shown where people are very fond of tea. We see a tea pet master in an old house who along with his wife used to make small tea pets whose specialty was that after pouring tea, they change their color. Today master makes a lady tea pet who is named Xiong and taken care of, but only then his wife gets a heart attack, on which the tea pet falls, and the squirrel runs away by taking tea pet, and the master's wife dies. The master stops their work and sells their tea pets to the tea shop. The shopkeeper tells people who came to his shop, that tea pet can change their color by pouring tea, and everyone is happy to see it. But the shopkeeper does not pour only one tea pet, whose name is Tang. A girl starts putting tea on Tang, but the shopkeeper stops her and tells her that its color does not change, so I feel it is useless and will throw it away someday, then we are shown the scene of the night. That after all the humans are gone, tea pet becomes alive, Tang is very mischievous, disturbs each other, and goes to his friend, whose name is Piggy. He had always studied physics. Tang sadly sits on the window, Piggy comes to Tang and explains to Tang that color is not everything. So you don't have to worry about your color, but Tang says that, he will do anything to change his color. My color will also change on pouring tea and now he starts dreaming that after changing his color, all will like it. The next morning we are shown a mini robot in the mountains roaming coming to the city, coming down the same way and reaching bumping here and there, and getting to that tea shop. All tea pets are scared seeing him now, and when the robot activates like everyone gets more scared. So Tang asks the robot who are you? And where did you come from? The robot told them that I came from today after three years have come from the future then shows them a tunnel of light through which he came into, this world, but Tang don't believe him that he come from the future that's why, he tells the robot that you have to prove, because if you come from the future, so you must know everything about the past. With the help of its advanced system, the robot sees that a plane is going to pass from there, after a while it passes from there, then everyone believes it, it seems to be there from the future, seems to be there from the future, and now shopkeeper starts coming back. The robot comes under the table then a delivery boy comes over there to deliver, the delivery boy pours tea on Tang, which Tang feels is good. Tang goes and asks the robot what is your name, then the robot tells him that I don't have any name. Then Tang puts his name as Xiao Lai. Tang takes him to the side and praises him saying you are very smart and you have come from the future. So you must know, how can I change my color? The robot scans Tang but he gets no result in his data, that's why Xiao Lai tells him that his knowledge is limited but he can upgrade himself by returning home. Tang also likes the idea and tells him that you don't know anything about yourself. So we will go to the future from where he came and you will know about your existence. And he will be able to find out how can he change his color. Piggy tells that to go to the future they have to open a warm hole. Tang and the robot to go to the future come out of the window, seeing the ferris wheel built on the hill where Xiao Lai came from. And they started going ahead to the mountain, they have to fake a way to reach, to turn it on. They go to the control room and turn on the ferris wheel, by which they reach the top by hanging ferris wheel, they see the ring there, which makes them feel that this is the warm hole from which they can go to the future. They cross those rings but nothing happens that upsets them, the robot thinks that they have to cross the ring at super speed. They both cross the ring together but jump out and fall and bump here and there, they reach a pet shop. Animals come to them, in which the old turtle comes, then Tang explains to her the whole thing, that they want to go to the future but they do not know the way to go there, then Old Turtle tells them that they have to find Tree Hole Man, which answers your all question, it is very difficult, they live in the dark, and that's why you go through underground. Tang is happy to go, and Old Turtles tell him that because there is a Flash territory area, their leader's name is Flash, which kills many tea pets. Tang gets scared but leaves to go and they fall into the gutter. Tang sees the robot following the order given by Tang. If Tang wants to roam around, Xiao Lai starts roaming around, it is a lot of fun, but Xiao Lai gets angry and says so don't do this, then they start moving forward, and the robot is very sad about the way. Tang gets a crystal ball which had a ferris wheel. Tang gifts it to Xiao Lai and says that we both are friends Xiao Lai becomes very happy, then water starts coming into the gutter. Both try to climb up but get swept away in the water and reach very low. Tang starts hanging but is saved by Xiao Lai. Let's see Piggy, one who is interested in physics and starts playing so that he can reach the future. Tang and Xiao Lai found two mice, they tell them that we are the residents of here and live in this ditch, but this place not looking for safety for you, Tang tells us that we are finding tree hole man. Mice tell that it is a dangerous area of the Flash's territory, but you don't worry, we will take you to tree hole man safely, bringing both of them to their home. They take them into their mice world, which is very beautiful. It is known that both mice lied and they work for Flash, who is a robber who used to harm tea pets and stole very valuable things. He also locked many tea pets in cages. So Tang gets very scared. Flash said to see gets very scared. 
Flash said to Xiao Lai that I was looking for him, and the robot asked do you know where I came from? Then Flash tells Xiao Lai that I had sent both mice, Motu and Patlu into the lab, where the scientist makes you, but it took three years to become complete you. Both mice are stealing you, but due to their stupidity, you went out of the lab. The scientist tried to catch you, but you dropped from the mountain. But you were deactivated, that's why you didn't know anything and I've been looking for you ever since. Tang sees Xiong who was the same tea pet that Flash stole and Tang tells Xiong we were both made by the master. But Xiong doesn't recognize Tang. Flash angrily starts to kill the Tang, but the robot saves Tang and also frees Xiong. The robot starts leaving from there taking Tang and Xiong with it. The Flash orders its comrades to catch them but the robot cleverly escapes from there, they start leaving, but Flash catches the leg of Xiong, then throws both Tang and Xiong into the water. The Xiao Lai gets angry and starts hitting Flash, but when Flash says to stop, he stops. Because he is a voice command robot that used to work on giving commands to anyone, that's why when Flash is told to go back, it leaves to go. Flash is surprised, Flash understands that Xiao Lai follows his orders. Tang was sink into the water because he was made of soil. On another side, Xiao Lai comes into the research center, where an AI comes in front of him. Robot asked is it a future? AI tells him that is the Robot Research Institute. Xiao Lai knows that is not a future. AI tells him that you were created by the scientist for domestic work to help people in work. And a voice command chip was fitted inside him that's why you follow everyone's command. Xiao Lai asks if I am not from the future, then how do I have a wormhole image in my system? An AI tells him that it is not a wormhole image, it is because of your thermal imaging motion capture. It makes the robot very sad. There are many robots appear who used to work on voice commands like him, and then I'll activate all robots, but Xiao Lai does not like it. The Xiao Lai says to AI that I have not to like to get Lai leaves through the vent to find his friend. We are shown Piggy who is also looking for Tang had reached the gutter, but their Piggy was surrounded by both mice. When they come to know that Piggy is a Tang friend, they take him. Tang is trying to get out of the water, but now Lampfish is calm there, and Tang gets scared. But then the fish gets trapped in a machine, Tang helps her and gets her out, then she came with his family, and she becomes his friend. So she gets Tang out of the water. Flash kidnaps Piggy and all her friends and asks them about the Xiao Lai robot. But when Piggy doesn't tell them anything then Flash tears the pages of his favorite physics book. But Piggy still doesn't tell him anything, Tang starts moving but only the mice look at him and catch him then Xiao Lai comes there and saves him, which Tang is very happy and fight starts between the robot and the rat, Tang and the Xiao Lai defeats rat, which makes Tang happy. Tang tells Xiao Lai they have to save Xiong's life, but Xiao Lai tells I can't go with you as the voice command of Flash can control me. The Xiao Lai tells him a complete story, that he is not from the future. Xiao Lai sees and who was stuck in the water and pulls her out. The robot wants to ask Tree Hole Man, how can I stop myself from voice commands? Tang is also very sad. They go to find Tree Hole Man during their journey, they have a lot of fun and support each other to get out of every trouble. The Xiao Lai comes to know that he is about to reach the Tree Hole Man according to the map told by Old Turtle. Only then he sees a lot of toys and animals, they are going to ask their questions from the Tree Hole Man. Tang and the Xiao Lai also go with them. They reach a stage where there were a lot of crowds. Then there a lady frog comes and tells that today is Tree Hole Man's birthday. So you have to fight with my frogs you have to go on another side by winning the frogs. Only the one who wins can ask questions. They get scared because whoever was going inside was coming after being completely beaten up. The Xiao Lai goes inside, but Frog catches him. Tang helps him and goes fighting with them, and safe Xiao Lai. Tang wins and gets a chance to ask the question from Tree Hole Man, but here we come to know that Tree to ask the question from Tree Hole Man, but here we come to know that Tree Hole Man is a computer. Tang asked the question from the computer, but only then did rats of flash come. All animals get scared and they run and the bridge breaks, Xiao Lai tells Tang about it, and Tang says to remain silent. The Xiao Lai is off and many things fall on the Xiao Lai. So Tang gets upset, but only then a man named Shan comes there, which used to work in the robotics lab, and that place was his storeroom. And a lot of damage was done to Xiao Lai, but Shan fixes it and when he goes out to buy some stuff, Tang reaches there, but Xiao Lai doest activates. Tang thinks that if he takes Xiao Lai to the Ferris wheel, maybe it will be fine, and he takes Xiao Lai and leaves there. He passes all the difficulties. He takes Xiao Lai in front of the Ferris wheel, due to the lights the robot activates. Xiao Lai recovers. Tang is overjoyed. Now they start talking together. Tang tells Xiao Lai that the Tree Hall Man was not a man, but a website where people could discuss their questions. But now on's life. Xiao Lai says that together we will save her, but Tang didn't want Flash to harm Xiao Lai, so. He turns off Xiao Lai by pressing the button and hides Xiao Lai in the control room and goes from there. 
Tangs with the help of fish open the water, on Flash's side. Due to this, the water does seem to be filled there and rats start drowning in the water, getting the opportunity. He frees all their friends and Xiong, and they sit on fish and go from there. Tang and Xiong start going down a gutter but only then Xiao Lai comes who helps them and saves them from going inside. Flash gets very angry to see that his castle has been destroyed. On the other side, Tang asks Xiao Lai how did you come here, then Xiao Lai tells Tang that they're in the control room a guard was switched by a mistake and I come here to save him. All of Tang's friends let's give thanks to Tang to save their lives. Tang, Xiong, and Xiao Lai come to the master's house, but only then does Flash comes there, who takes advantage of being Xiao Lai like a voice command robot and controls Xiao Lai with his voice and starts attacking Tang and Xiong. Inside the Xiao Lai, Tang given gift comes out, and glitches come to Xiao Lai system, and so he remembers that Tang is his friend and now he breaks his voice command chip, and starts attacking Flash forcefully by dropping him away and throwing him out. Tang was happy, but Flash was not killed and now turns on the furnace, Xiao Lai moves to save Tang and Xiong's life, but Flash starts attacking them. The Xiao Lai breaks the door to get out but Flash grabs the leg of Tang. The Xiao Lai tries to save him from the Flash but, when Tang sees that the Xiao Lai's hand gets damaged, so he leaves himself and falls with Flash into a furnace of fire and ends up with him, there is a loud explosion occurs and now the Xiao Lai and Xiong fall further. The next morning, the master wakes up and is very surprised to see the furnace on. When he sees the furnace, the master found Tang, who turned completely black. The master remembers that this is the new tea pet that he had made with his wife. So he reworks the Tang and paints it white, Xiong likes the color of Tang very much. They both very much. They both go out to find the Xiao Lai, but they see that the Xiao Lai is completely broken the ants were collecting his parts because Xiao Lai helps the one ant. So they take the robot to Shan to fix it and Shan fixes it again. Tang is happy to see him and Xiao Lai starts increasing his knowledge from the net, and Tang was also happy with